So today's my bike's first MO2. Um, well, not necessarily today, I'm going to drop it off today and tomorrow I'm going to go through the actual test. So right now it's a Honda 125. What I was doing was basically checking the light. Four and a half, four and a half. Done. I'm just going to see the light. Time is again. This time is actually quite fresh. As you see. And uh, the chain is quite fresh. And the spot is fresh. It's not even hanging yet. Nothing is hanging. I try to keep it clean and everything. Pissing down there. And I've got a rider. This is the first time. First time I'm taking my bike in the rain. I haven't ridden the bike in the rain yet. Not something I'm looking forward to. Just simply because uh, extra care and caution I'm going to take. And um, I've got four gear gloves, helmet obviously. Let's go. Well, I officially got drenched. Just about to see. All wet, dropped off the bike to the bike shop. So, hello, hello, it's me back again. So I picked up the bike, I'm going to show you the little video that uh, the man sent me. There was an issue with the bike for the front caliper. Hi CJ, we was looking at your brake pads, yeah. You see the little corner there, they're not supposed to be have that one. The pads is not sitting properly on the disc how it should be. See this mark here, you should, you should touch over there and they're doing like that and we find out the caliper hold is bent you see one up one down they're not supposed to be like that this one is supposed to be straight so you're gonna have to change the brake parts and what we're gonna do try to make this one straight for you okay now it's all fit Fitted the new brake pads. Uh, there's like a little line in there, but no, I can't actually feel it. The disc is straight, new pads, all good. New oil, uh, what else? The spot plug, actually, the seat in. Yeah, warm. Ooh. Yeah, silly thing for me. Uh, the engine is running, you can probably hear it. The um, spot plug is fresh. Everything is quite cleaned up. Uh, new air filter, which is inside there. Everything is fine. We cleaned up, oiled up the grease up. The chain, chain is good. Um, as I was saying, the sprocket is new, chain is new, tire is new. Well, at the back, the front one is pretty new. Um, it's a Honda. It is cool. What I like about it right now is that it doesn't drink anything. I a month ago I put 12 pounds uh, full tank and it's still half a tank. Actually, no, 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 no. It's getting closer. Yep, it's still half a tank. Half a tank. It doesn't drink anything. 12,000, 12,500 miles. So new fresh oil at 12,500 miles. Checked everything over. Everything is beautiful. Everything is cool, legit, clean, immaculate. Whatever you want to say. Everything is standard. Everything is stock as it should be. 
it's a beautiful bike. Oh, the only thing is not stock is the light bulb in there, which is much brighter than uh, the stock one. The previous one stacked that BMC air filter. I'm going to take that off with a bit of a heat gun because it's just not here nor there. It's just pointless. You like a few little stickers, but yeah, I don't like it. I think it should be without it. That's okay. This one is like a tag protector. It's fine, but that sticker needs to come off. As I was saying. The bike is uh, freshly serviced. I'm gonna be maybe looking into part with it uh, in the next couple of months' time when I actually pass my full license. Gonna do module one, module two. I'm training for it right now. Done my theory. Everything's good past that. So yeah, the next step would be passing the license and getting a bigger bike. Watch this space, as they say. Right, thanks guys for watching me. Uh, speak to you guys later.